What's up YouTube, this is Shady Panther, back with a video. In today's video is actually another Demon Slayer box office uh, update. Again, I will link the article in the description box down below so you guys can check it out. This comes from Deadline.com. It says, Demon Slayer is now the biggest IMAX title ever in Japan as anime smashes train sites on more box office records and it shows you freaky shows strong in Australia. But yeah, we're going to talk more about the Demon Slayer news because that's the most important thing out of all this whole entire stuff. Um... Trying to see Japan adaptation, blah blah blah, in Rap City. Uh, I'm trying to find the exact uh, thing with uh, Demon Slayer. Okay, I guess this is it. Okay, it says uh, turning back to IMAX fifth weekend of Demon Slayer uh, was worth one. I guess it uh, was worth 1.4 million in 38 IMAX screens, a drop of only three percent from the previous frame, which is crazy. How it's doing that well. With a perfect screen average of 36K in Taiwan, uh, Demon Slayer adds 225K from nine IMAX screens, reaching a market come out of 750, 710K, a near 79K uh, per screen after only 10 days of playing IMAX, despite in the second week of nationwide release. Hong Kong released Demon Slayer this weekend, will get IMAX treatment next season. Session again, we are um, awaiting official updates for those markets, and it goes on and on and on and on. But again, and also, I read this thing is that it made uh, where's another thing? I looked on uh, this other uh, Twitter, whatever, uh, France speech. It says Demon Slayer made uh, 238 million worldwide. So, if you don't know, the worldwide box office for this year is like it's 800. 800, I guess a Chinese movie, Bad Boys for Life, My People, Homeland, Tenet, Sonic the Hedgehog, Doolittle, Legend of uh, Defestication, Demon Slayer, and Birds of Prey. So it's crazy how Demon Slayer already beat Birds of Prey. I do think uh, it could possibly beat Tenet, maybe. I'm not sure. But it has a chance of beating Spirit Away, because I guess Tenet's done is pretty much done because it's going to be on home video next month but overall i told you guys before i'm happy for demon slayer i'm happy that it's now i guess what this set what is it i gotta look at it it's like the eighth highest grossing box office of the year so far which is crazy and insane in my personal opinion it's like this just shows you america is that you could drop a uh, a movie and people will show up as long as it's good. I know it's Japan and Japan is different in America, but it just shows you how much they love Demon Slayer because Demon Slayer is making that bread. And right now with Demon Slayer, uh, you know the record's doing very well. I think it is. It's definitely going to be the highest selling manga of this year. The problem after Demon Slayer is done, so there's nothing more you can do. Um, I'm really curious of how. Uh, much money or how much they can milk this franchise because i like demon slayer don't get it wrong but demon slayer it's like it's done you know what i mean like you could do a few animes you could do season two stuff like that but i'm really curious about what you guys gonna do for with this franchise you know what i mean because this franchise is making a lot a lot of money and it's doing very very well doing better than what people expected so again that's pretty much it guys i just wanted to give you another demon slayer box office update uh tell me what you guys think about this do you think it's gonna be one of the highest uh, worldwide box office of this year i personally think so because it's not going to be anything that's going to stand up to it especially in american box office or just in the worldwide box office uh wonder woman's supposed to come out but you know they're going to cut that out you know this would be honest they're going to probably push it back to next year or whatever it is so again that's pretty much it guys let me know in the comment section below make sure you rate and like the video and subscribe make sure you subscribe to the channel peace and have a great day and take care